What's the crack, lads? Welcome back. And now we are going to be taking a look at our legendary Rivaldo. So if you have signed him for free, we're going to pop in and see what we're going to train him up like, right? So obviously you're going to be getting these players for free. And the two things you need to keep in keep in mind when you are signing these players is the team play style, proficiency, and how they're going to set up in your squad. Now, Rivaldo is very similar to Ronaldinho. They both interchange very, very nicely. Very kind of similar height, um, tight possession, dribbling, ball control, speed, acceleration, all that sort of stuff, right? But the thing that Rivaldo has got going for him is the fact that he only needs one into possession game, right? The same as Ronaldinho, but he also has uh, three more points to spend in his progression points, which is one more level into your dexterity, which makes a big difference in this card, right? So we are going to take a look here in a second as he's maxed out. But first, we are going to take a look at his player skills. So very similar to Ronaldinho, he doesn't have one touch pass, which is a bit of a pity. I'd be playing R R Rivaldo more as a kind of a shooting um, attacking midfielder. And this is what I'm talking about. If you don't shoot a lot with Rivaldo, you're not going to get the best out of him because he has long range curler, long range shooting and acrobatic finishing. So he's not going to be passing that much, which is why we're not going to focus massively on his passing like we would with Guti or Zico or one of those Ronaldinho type AMFs that is just going to sit in the pocket and, you know, rip you apart with passes, deft touches and whatever. Rivaldo is going to be more direct, linking up, running into the box, getting shots, kind of like Frank Lampard's card, um, except a faster version of him. So when we take a look at his stats here, we've got 23 levels to go. We've just popped one into possession game there. And then that brings it up to 80. The rest of the team play styles are kind of, you are screwed if you don't play possession game because it's going to take up. You could put two into out wide or long ball and that wouldn't be a massive difference um, to his stats. But what we're going to do here is this is what I think is the best build. Get that up to 80 and 80. That will be enough with the other player skills that he does have. So with the player skills that he has already, you're going to get an absolute monster there for the shooting and for the curling, the finishing and the curling, right? So you need to be shooting with him, using a lot of curl shots, finesse shots, um, deft touch control, standing shots, all that sort of stuff. Passing, we're going to leave passing for the moment. Now, I would like to get it up over 80 for the low pass, but we'll see in a second. We'll see how we go, right? We've got 20 points left to go. Dribbling is where you really want to kind of pump in stuff. Get your ball control up to 94 into that. We also want to put this up to 6. So we want 80 acceleration and 85 offensive awareness, but we also want our balance up over 72, 73. We don't need to worry too much about his lower body because his speed is going to be enough. His stamina, we're not going to be able to improve that no matter what we do. And now I would probably pump one more into shooting and I would probably put two more into dexterity or else one more in there and one more here. And that leaves us with one left over that we can either put into lower body to get the stamina up or we can put in passing to bring it up to 80. So that's where I would go with him. I think Ronaldinho is a good, or Rivaldo is a good player. Ronaldinho is a good option as well if you're a pass first player. But I definitely think that this guy Rivaldo can get you a lot of goals. So that is it, lads. We've Cafu next, and then that will finish off all the Legends training guides and complete breakdown. If you're enjoying this series, you've stumbled onto the channel, welcome in. We do a lot of content, two videos daily, where we try to do everything that we possibly can to grow the channel and get the content out. Live streaming as well as a regular thing on the channel now as well. So appreciate all the support, and uh, we will see you back soon. Don't forget to subscribe and share. Peace.